the software that we could use it So today we're gonna try to learn how do we design the uh, user interface design with the Vigma. So Vigma is the free application that we could use to design the user interface for free whenever you are. Means that no matter if you are using the Windows or even you know like maybe another operating system you still able to use the Vigma okay so let me show you how it works so first we need to uh, create the frame with the maybe just go with the iPhone X wow this is too long we change it to the Android okay and I change the name of frame which is uh, send in just like this and do not worry because it's already to be auto save here which is maybe first app okay and it's auto save whenever you try to save it it's gonna be auto save like that okay and yeah that is very nice uh, you are able to design it for free and you don't have to be worried with the operating system okay and then right now we need to uh, create the background itself for the login okay so uh, over here I'm going to make you know like another section so just use the rectangle over here and then we click like this okay and we make it full just like that okay and then we are able to change it to the uh, uh, linear because we want to make it a gradient okay just like this so the first color it has to be blue uh, no like this I'm just going to copy and like this okay but the problem is where is our color oh here we go and then I'm trying to make it different color okay just like this and like this okay amazing yeah and then what else uh, we need to uh, design the a section for the user so if you click here we need to create another rectangle just put here and then we put just like this okay and then we need the radius so if you click here and this is for setting the radius is about a 30 Oh, no maybe 50 and this one about 50 just like this and make it white color okay like this All right and this one maybe you can say like uh, hello good morning everyone like that so this one has to be uh, welcome to oh no no Maybe this is supposed to be a welcome back. Okay. And if you want to change the font type, just put over here and then change to the uh, Montserrat. Just like that. And you might want to change the color to a little bit gentle. Like this. Okay. And then increase it just like this. Okay. Amazing right and i think we need a bigger maybe 24 yeah just like this 
and we need to duplicate and make it smaller like 14 and this one supposed to be like with the different color just like this login to your account to get an update okay just like this right okay I'm going to put about four. Yes. Okay, cool. And then we need to uh, we need to create the button and then for the input like username and then password for the user. So, but firstly, I have to create another ellipse here, just like this. Okay, and then I just put here. Okay, and make it a little bit a silver. We could just copy here, and then put here. But I think it has to be a little bit softer, like this. Okay. And I'm going to duplicate it and make it, you know, like a little bit darker. Just like this. Okay. And I'm going to duplicate this and make it bigger. Just like this. And we have to group them. Just group selection. And this one, it has to be mass. Okay, where is pass? Okay. Alright, so it will be a user. I'm going to make it smaller. Okay, just like this. Okay, amazing, right? So, what else? Uh, yeah, we need to uh, make it little bit. So I think that we have to design the uh, user section. So here I'm going to make uh, another rectangle, but I will make it full like this. And then I will decrease it by 24, uh, 48. Okay. And then we are able to make it like this. Okay. And this one, I am going to just duplicate it. And we can just give same thing. And you have to change the color like this. Okay. And then maybe we need to uh, give it to a little bit bigger, like 24 or no, maybe like 18, yeah. Okay. And for this one, I need stroke. The stroke color has to be white. And this one has to be a little bit purple, like this, okay. And then I'm I'm giving them 200 dp, just like this. And then what else? We need to copy this, and then we have to put on the top and make it smaller. So this is for the username. and we need to group them and duplicate it so this is for the password nice yeah 
and then I think that we need the button here for the user so I just want to duplicate it sign in okay and make it like regular and bigger Okay, and I just want to remove the stroke and change the color. Maybe we could go with the uh, yellow. But I think if we are using the yellow color for the background, then we have to use a darker color. This and make it medium. Okay, amazing, right? And maybe we need this one. We can just duplicate here. Uh, reset my password. Okay, and we put fourteen, and with the white color. Okay, amazing, right? So this is for the send in. And this is for the reset password. Okay, so if you wanna try to, sorry, if you wanna try to preview, just click here, present, and it will preview your application in the web. Okay, and you can also uh, see it just like this. Uh, maybe you wanna share the prototype, anyone with the link, okay, and just copy. And I'm going to put here, like here. Okay, so this is the design for the same in and hope you enjoy for this tutorial. Maybe we can try to implement it into the Android Studio later on. So I'll see you in the next video. So goodbye for now. Thank you and do not forget to subscribe my YouTube channel. So goodbye.